Hey everyone, welcome. I'm Justin and I uh, welcome you to my YouTube channel. If you haven't already, please click that like and subscribe button and you're probably wondering what am I liking and subscribing to? I believe that real life needs real life questions and answers and the answer, the question and the answer is Jesus. And I believe in contextualizing scripture is going to give us the correct answer to our life's issues and life's questions and quandaries, if you will. So click that like and subscribe button because I believe in going to the word of God and getting not a conservative answer, not a liberal answer, but just getting the right answer. I've been to school for this. I have went to Marquette University, Vanderbilt University, Boston University. I've been pastoring for some 10 years now, and I've had a lot of questions as a pastor, and this series, for me, is an opportunity to give some answers. So let's jump into today's question and answer session. So I want to engage in this question and answer today. Can I smoke weed? Is it a sin to use marijuana? Is it a place where it's legal to do so? Okay. I can give you a bunch of governmental stuff and talk about obeying the rules of the land and all of that type of stuff. But here's the answer. Weed isn't a sin. Now, before you isolate me and crucify me, if you're using it for an addiction, if you're using it as a means of escape, if you're using it as a means to desecrate your body, then totally it's a sin. And in some ways we've made weed a sin. Is it okay to smoke weed? Yeah, is it okay to be addicted to weed? No. Is it okay to get high? No. For medicinal purposes, cannabis, the active chemicals in medical marijuana, are similar to the chemicals in the body that's involved in appetite, memory, movement, and pain. Limited research on this says that weed reduces anxiety, reduces inflammation, relieves pain, controls nausea and vomiting caused by cancer chemotherapy, it kills cancer cells, it slows tumor growth, it relaxes tight muscles to people with MS, it stimulates your appetite, and improves weight gain with people who have cancer age. Recreational marijuana is not the same thing. Recreational weed is not consistent with anything in the word of God. Now, if you're using it for medicinal purposes, it has medicinal reasons. If you're using it for recreational reasons, to be addicted and to get high and to escape, no, it's completely wrong. You are a Christian and we are to be transformed by the renewing of our mind. Romans chapter 12, verse number two, not by the deadening of our minds. You are to be sober minded about the devil's schemes. You are to know first Peter five verses eight through nine. You need a mind that is clear so that you know what is satanic and what is of God. You're going to be filled with the Holy Spirit, Ephesians 5 and 18, not filled with something inside of you that's causing you to make different decisions. So does the government's decision on weed matter? No. Is it okay to smoke weed for, per for particular reasons? Certainly. Is it okay to be addicted? Is it okay to be high? No. If you are doing anything that's going to distance you from making clear, level-headed decisions in the word of God, it's wrong. And weed, along with alcohol, is one of those things. If helpful to you and you like these questions and answer times, please, please like and subscribe because I believe in just bringing the scriptures directly to you. And if you disagree or agree, go ahead in the comment section. I'd love to engage with you. Please keep it civil and please keep it intentional. Let's keep our fight against the dark forces and not our fight against other people. So please like and subscribe. I have some other channels as well that are linked in the description below. Please engage, please like and subscribe and I look forward to seeing you next time we engage one of these questions. God bless you.